Now let's install WordPress on our Windows. We go to wordpress.org slash download and we click on download WordPress and this is the latest version 5.5.3 at the time of making this video. Now, we download it. After download, we go to Windows C sorry windows c and we go to example folder and we paste it we go to the ht docs and we paste it here and extract it because it is a zip file now i will name the folder as news app so remember guys we have extracted the WordPress in a folder called News App. Okay. And let's go to localhost slash news app. And let me see. News app. Maybe I forget to to run the example server let's go to example and here we go i forget to start the apache and mysql so in order to use the example you need to run it first and here we go guys we go to localhost slash news app and the installation of wordpress has been started we we'll, we go to here and we need to create a database name, username, password, database host, and table prefix. Let's start by making a database name. Localhost php my admin slash my admin. Okay. And let's create a new here, new database and database name i will name it as master coding okay and database is created this is the database master coding i will create a new notepad file in order to save all our credentials so our database name on XAMPP is master coding okay back to the localhost installation of WordPress put the uh, database name master coding I will put the username root password no password database local uh, host is localhost and the table prefix we will get it okay so master coding root no password localhost and table prefix wp underscore run the installation on site title I will put a site title here master coding news app <coughs> our username is master coding or admin let me put it as admin and the password is admin let me also save them as username admin and the password is admin in order not to forget anything later on in coding okay website username and website password okay email master coding 999 gmail.com
install WordPress. And everything. Now let's log in. And here we go, guys. Congratulations. We have installed WordPress correctly on our local host. Okay. So everything is working fine. These are the scenes, the user, the tools. And this is the dashboard of the WordPress. And this is our site. It's called localhost slash news app. This, uh, this is the database and this is the website that we are going to work with in our app. So this, our, this is our dashboard and WordPress is installed correctly.